Hey guys, my name is Christine. I'm a writer with The Field Talk and Gilbert forced me to make a video, um, even though I hate being on camera, uh, to talk a little bit about what I'm doing in quarantine. Um, so one of the things I really love is learning about like the daily habits and rituals of top athletes, especially soccer players, when you know they're away from the training field, what they do at home. Um, to give them that little bit of extra edge. And one of those things is, you know, just stretching and mobility. Um, I myself have not been able to play for about like eight months or so, a little bit longer. Um, I had an ACL tear, knee surgery, and uh, you know, it's a really difficult process as many of you know, um, but thanks to some really great physical therapists in LA, I've been able to recover um, very well. And so now that I'm at home, I just am trying to spend like an hour every day just stretching, working on the ankles, um, you know, the ligaments, the joints, and really like trying to get in tune with my body again, in addition to just like, you know, getting fit, getting your touch back and things like that. Um, shout out to my physical therapist, Anderson Lopez with uh, AJ Lopez Physical Therapy and um, Craig Lindell's the other one with the Prehab Guys. Um, he, they have a huge following, so if you guys need a good physical therapist, definitely check them out. Um, some of the things I'm doing, I actually just moved into a new place, so as you can see I have like a crazy amount of boxes to unpack, so that's kind of good timing, so um, I am taking my sweet time to unpack everything, I'm just trying to make my home a really uh, comfortable uh, space for writing, um, for video production and editing, uh, which is what I do with the Field Talk, and I'm also a writer with um, Urban Soccer Park, uh, which is a fantastic company. Uh, they build short-sided soccer fields all across the nation um, with, you know, turf flooring, futsal flooring. They can build on rooftops and in schools, indoors, outdoors. Um, and I work with a, you know, a great team of people there. My boss, Jen Short, is um, also one of the directors of the U.S. Women's Futsal Team. So really wonderful, you know, wealth of soccer knowledge um, working with them. Um, I have a lot of plans to watch like tons of soccer games. So I saw today that UFA like released a TV app where they're showing like old Champions League games. So that's another thing that you can also do. And I guess like my advice to people is just to, you know, as a journalist, like I see sometimes people get their news from non-trusted and non-vetted sources. And I think like in this very surreal, like crazy, unprecedented time that we're going through, it's really important that we get our news from um, reputable news sources because just like in any field, um, there are sources that have trained professionals that know how to fact check and know how to put information in context that's really gonna um, make sure that we understand um, what we should be doing and understand the context of how to stay safe. And um, yeah. Other than that, I'm going to be, you know, interacting with the Field Talk community and hopefully seeing all of you guys soon.